Bismillah wa salat wa salam ala Rasulullah. Hello everyone, today we're going to start our last unit which focuses on writing negative sentences in simple future. As we do, usually we're going to review the objectives of this lesson. Number one, we are going to let the student know the structure of the future simple tense. Two, we're going to let the student know when to use a future simple tense. And the last objective is to teach students how to negate sentences in the future simple tense. Now, let's start by reviewing the structure and use, how it is uh, constructed, how it is formed, and how it is used. The Simple future tense is the tense that is constructed by the use of the auxiliary will plus verb in its base form or what we call verb 1. Now with all pronouns we use the same auxiliary verb which is will plus verb 1. So it doesn't matter if you are talking about they, we, you, he, she, it, or I. We use the same auxiliary verb which is will. Now we use this tense to talk about a decision that we've just made now about the future. So if we are here now, then we are talking about a decision that we want to do in the future in this area. Here we have now some examples about this. I will travel to Greece this summer. She will study Spanish next month. They will go fishing. He will take a summer course. We will cook fish. Notice with me that in all these sentences we use the same auxiliary verb although we have different pronouns for example here we have plural and here we have plural here we have singular and we use the same structure with all pronouns plus verb one. To make simple future sentences negative, we use will plus not. So we only use not. So we only add not after will. Let's make these sentences negative. They will not study all night long. Next month he will not become 10 years old. We will eat in 10 minutes. It becomes we will not eat in 10 minutes. So by this way we have made all these sentences negative. 